Hey guys, and welcome back to Tales of Asperia. Last time we met up with our friggin' red-headed hottie, Kaufman, and we're going to go on a boat. So yeah, are you ready? Yes. Let's do it. Bought all my healing items, saved it, ready to go. Yay! We're on a boat, bitch! Yeah, you knew that was coming. This is the Fiertia. Uh, she'll be your ship as soon as you have escorted her to Nordopolica. Cool. And this man is Tokunaga of Gull's Song, a maritime guild affiliated with Wurtz Mar Wait, Tokunaga? Is he a doll ridden by a small gold-digging girl? No. That sucks. Tokunaga is an expert in piloting the Fiertia. I'm Tokunaga. Uh, very nice to meet you. We're not in a hurry, but these are important negotiations, so we really appreciate your help. What is the ship's cargo? Uh, that's confidential information. Oh, okay, fine. It's nothing we should be worried about, is it? Relax, we've got it covered. Okay, alright, head towards Nordopolica. Go directly southwest from Torm Harbor and you'll see the Desi Air Continent. Nordopolica is at the eastern edge. Okay. I hope you won't mind if I go over the Fiertia's controls with you. Yeah, yeah. Alright, you can only disembark from the ship where there you see a dock, a port, or a beach. You won't be able to get onto land where there are cliffs. Of course, the ship can't pass over rocks, but you also have to keep her out of the shallows around islands. You might be able to take her into some rivers, but if they're deep enough. However, if there's a bridge spanning the river, you won't be able to take her under. We wouldn't want to clip off our mast. Okay, there are other places you can disembark from. Beware that there are monsters on the continents much stronger than you can handle right now. Okay, move, camera control, yada yada. And that's about it. Okay, so now we have a boat, and right now I'm not controlling it. Right now it's moving on its own. So, yeah. Do, do, do. Oh, this is so bad. We just started out and we're already working with one of the five master guilds. This is good. Yeah. You're one step closer to making your dream a reality, Carol. Aren't you happy? You talking to the kid? He's over there mumbling about something. Merman. The first thing had to be Merman. Brave Vesperia has some bad luck. What's the president of Fortune's Market gonna think of us if we fail? This is bad. This is so bad. I don't think he's very happy. He's just being careful, that's all. That's not being careful. That's running and hiding. <laughs> that's being a coward. But okay, uh, the Fiertia controls really, really easily. Like, as you can see, I'm basically doing donuts right now, so... Sharp turns are nothing to be worried about. This thing rocks. Oh no! Something! Is it the merman? It'll be nice if we don't run into the merman, won't it? Huh, that's pretty wishful thinking. You're quite the pessimist you for your age, girly. I'm just a realist. Anyway, thanks for your help. It looks like we're gonna make it there on time. Yep. Yeah, Leviathan's Claw was gonna beat us there if we hadn't found an escort for the ship. Leviathan's Claw, huh? That's a name I seem to be hearing a lot lately. Oh? They're the guild that specializes in sales of hope... Wait. They're the guild that's specializing in sales of hope on Blastia. Oh, that explains the situation in Heliord. Lately, they've been trying to steal our clients from us. If we weren't able to cross the sea, they would have swiped up another one of our major customers. Huh. Still, I can't help but wonder what those slime balls are getting their product from. Indeed, hope on Blastia isn't exactly the easiest thing in the world to get one's hands on. You don't think the Empire is behind this? Well, why would they work with the guild? No, that couldn't be. It's mages that are supervising the Blastia distribution. Ah, right on time. Everyone be careful! Oh my god, they're splashing! Oh wait, no, there's they jumped out. Sharkmen! Get ready. I'm taking you down. That's a lot of Sharkmans. A Predafish? I thought it was a Merman! Or Merman. What the hell? Predafish. Resistance water, weak to fire and wind. Oh, perfect. Check this out. Ooh, oh, man. <laughs> no, no, stop it. Stop it. Ow. Ooh, getting mauled by fish. Ooh, I hate fish. But yeah, people, I don't know why. People have been asking if, like, oh, do you not like Destruction Field? Uh, that's not the issue. I just forget that I have it, honestly. It's not, a, like... I don't not use it because I don't like it. It's just that I forget I even have the damn attack. I'm just so... Uh. Jeez, so many fish! Uh. 
Stop it! Oh my god, thank you, nurses. Woo! Oh, that was cool. I never saw the animation on the nurses. Like, I never knew they, like, threw their hands up in the air. It's like, yay! There, have some sparklies! You know, I never knew they did that. Ow, ow, ow. Destruction field! Ugh. Damn it. You're using too many arts. Oh, yeah. Oops. It's really powerful attack. Ugh. Yeah, see? Like, 1,500 damage. Ugh. Yeah. And I really love using it in an overlimit. It's really fun. Check this out. It's awesome. Ugh. Wait, wait, wait. Ugh. Ugh. No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> no, more. <laughs> oh, man, I thought that was going to kill him. Yeah, there we go. It's really fun to just, just, just spam it. It's awesome. <laughs> What's the secret of your strength? I don't know. My pointy years? Cool. I'll get those, too. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, no. Okay. Now what? You're true to your reputation. I was right to bring you... We have a reputation now? Okay, I was right to bring you along. Yep. I tell you, Brave Asperia doesn't have any shame in working with an old man down to the bone. <laughs> even while I'm looking for Apatheia and doing all sorts of other things. You we didn't even do anything! You weren't in the fight! I'll put you in the next one, dick. Alright. <laughs> Apatheia, isn't that what you were looking for back in Nor Harbor? That's right. That's nothing but a fairy tale. I researched it a while back, but eventually I realized that there's simply no way it can, be th it can theoretically exist. I'm well aware people think it's a fairy tale. Why are you looking for it? Well, because the Dawn told me to. Well then, we've got some business to talk about. I'll leave the navigation to you, Tokunaga. Actually, Madam President, would you mind if I handed over the navigation to them for a while? Ah, of course. We've made much better time than I thought. We could even afford to make a side trip or two. Okay. With a ship, we can go practically anywhere we want. Estelle, I know you want to look for Pharaoh. Uh, don't you think we have more important things to do for he do for the moment? Do you think? Uh, well, I'll do what I want. Don't worry about me. <laughs> we just started our guild. We should err on the safe side, don't you think, Carol? Y yeah. Alright then, I'll leave the navigation to you. Okay, thanks. So now they're basically just gonna set you free and you can do what you want, I think. Um, let's see. Uh, there we go. If you press X, you can make the map, you know, cover the whole screen, basically. Let me see here. Can I go back through the city? Can I go back? Yeah, I can. Okay. Yeah, let's just go back to the city. Um, let's see here. There's something I want to do really, really quick in... Um, oh, there's something I want to do in... Oh, I can't... Now, you see these dark spots in the water? I guess those are like shallows you can't go through. So, yeah. Um, whatever. I guess we can't go this way. But, um, there's something I want to do in, um, oh, what the hell was it called? Halur, that's it. There's something I want to do there, but I don't know if I'll be able to actually get there. So, yeah. Anyway. Um, oh, come on, really? Oh. Okay, well, anyway, what we need to do is go out here into open ocean, and then fog, oh my god! The fog's gotten awfully thick. Yeah, it's creeping me out. Fog like this is usually a sign something bad's about to happen. N knock it off! Talk like that long enough and something bad will happen. Hey, front! I mean bow! Hmm. We're going to hit them. Ow! What is that? That's an old ship. I've never seen that type before. I think it says... The Atherum. There's no sign of people. It, it's like, it's calling to us. 
No way! Come on! Get the fear tube going! The Ceres Blast is not responding! What do you mean? What the hell is wrong with it? You think this thing's the problem? Ooh, maybe it's a cursed ghost ship. Y you don't really think so, do you? Why don't we go take a look? It'll be fun. I love this sort of thing. What? Well, we don't know what's wrong with the Blastia. We gotta go take a look. Are you planning on just leaving the Fiertia like this? All right, why don't four of us go investigate while the rest stay here and keep watch? That should be fine. Okay, so repeat and I'll go. <clears throat> and who's the third person? I'm not going, no way! Yuri, why don't you decide? Gotcha. Okay, so it's Yuri, Rapide... Well, I already know who I'm taking. Oh! Oh, thank God. Healing circle. Alright, so Yuri, Rapide, Rita... I had to fix the Ceres Blastia. Nope. I I'm not scared or anything. Alright, I'll go with you. And let's get Raven. Alright, you want Raven the Great? Hell yeah! Phew, I can hardly keep up with you kids. Oh, shut up. You're fine. Let's go! Depart with current members? Yeah. Be careful out there. I'll fire a signal when the Ceres Blastia is fixed. Okay. Thanks! Alright, what Raven's good for. So, what possessed you to bring old Raven along? Huh? I just figured you'd come in handy, I guess. You know, you just ain't too bright. It's the perfect chance for some alone time with the ladies. What's the fun in having two guys here? Ah, I'm scared! Help! Never fear, kitten. Daddy's right here. That's the way these things are supposed to go down. If we run into any trouble, I'm using you to save my own skin. Got it? Huh? So that's how I come in handy? A decoy? Well, it makes sense. <laughs> Don't worry, kitten. Daddy's here. <laughs> oh my god, that's so... Oh, that's really creepy, Raven. <laughs> that's like really freaking creepy, but okay. Uh, Trident. That's for Judith, obviously, but I didn't bring Judith, so I can't equip it. I wish I didn't have to bring Rapide. I didn't want to bring Rapide. And why could, Why didn't I get the skit with Rita? I wanted to see a skit where she was, like, really, really scared. Oh, I should have saved it first and then picked somebody else, like Carol. Oh. Anyway, you come way up here, treasure chest, and you get a seal bottle, limit bottle, specific, and a treat. That is really, really good. Wait a minute, can I climb up any higher? Is there any other ladder up here? No? Okay, I guess not. But yeah, I highly recommend you uh, get those. Those are really good. Um, I forget... Let me see here. I always forget which one's which. Ah, specific heals 30% of max TP for all party members, and treat is 30% uh, of max HP for all party members. So, those are incredibly useful. Um... Use those when you need them. Like, when you actually really need them, use them. Like, don't just use them on a whim. They're rare, and they're expensive. Let's eliminate them. Man, I wanted Rita to be scared. Aqu Aquates Assassin? Or Aqua Aquates? I don't know. <laughs> uh, that's the, uh, the crab there. What? I missed them when they were called Crab Man. Oh, around, huh? Ow, stop it. Now, this may have been a bad decision on my part because I did not bring Estelle. But that's why I brought Raven, because he can learn a healing art. I just don't know if he's going to get it anytime soon. I hope he does. Uh, Rita, let's go ahead and use a magic lens on the Hawks. Okay. Pretty weak. That's good. Did you get out of here? Ugh. Ah! Oh, man, I missed it. Ugh. Come on. Ugh. Are you going to learn your thing, Raven? Please. <laughs> I might have to use a whole bunch of items. Man, do you not have it? Uh, he doesn't. No, I want it to be there. Come on, man. Whoop. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I missed really bad. I missed bad. <laughs> oh, well. There we go. 
Come on. Damn birds. Stop it. Oh, just trying to kill the crab. Oh, whoops. Whoop. Oh, you missed. The hell. Boom. No. I don't like to cry of victory. It's dumb. But okay. Um, if you come up here. Another hawk. Oh, augury sword. Oh, God. No. Okay, thank you. I got the augury sword. Cool. But now I'm going to lose my, uh, what's it called? Link Slash and Fatal Slash. A demonic sword known as the Master Slayer. Appears during wars and spreads calamity and causes transition. Okay. Let me see here. I got 11. So let's see. Oh, I can get my combo plus. Cool. Got it. So I can keep my combo plus. Very nice. Um, let's go down here, I guess. Go into the ship. Ooh, it's scary. Um, let's see. Oh no, it's a ghost in the mirror that I can't see unless I see it in the mirror. Ooh, damn it. Oh, there's no challenge at all. Don't let him trip you up. So okay, uh, there's some ghost enemies in this area where you can only see them in the mirror. So yeah, it's important to know that. Um, that way you don't think the game has a glitch in it or something where it's like, dude, I'm running into an enemy that doesn't. Damn it, repeat! I was gonna do that. Man, boom. Ow. So yeah, just stay dead. <laughs> really? I didn't expect her to say that. So yeah, just stay dead. <laughs> that was pretty good. Okay. Ah, there it is, right there. Ooh, no! It's a ghost. What is that thing, anyway? Anchor Geist. Okay. Uh, magic lens on the Anchor Geist. 15,000. It's pretty weak. Thank God. But yeah, you're going to see other enemies of this type eventually. Um, they're going to be... They're going to be relatively annoying because they usually have some type of elemental resistances. Like, this guy resists a lot of different things. And they're going to cost you a lot of grade in fights. It's really, really annoying when they when they do. That was close. Oh, you're fine. Oh, hey, I got a life bottle. Awesome. It's 500 bucks. I don't got to spend on another one. Okay. It's a long hallway in this friggin' ship. Oh no, there's two things coming for me at once. Oh, and I ran away. Okay. <laughs> uh, oh, damn it. <laughs> oh man. All right. Things are everywhere. Go away. All right. I'm, oh, shut up, Yuri. You're fine. If Raven would friggin' learn the thing, God. Okay, here. Now. Bam! There we go. Eat it. Kaboom. No. I don't want the stupid cry of victory. Okay. Jeez. Oh, magic lens. Nice. Oh no, it's over there. Oh, damn it. I feel like an easy win. Ooh, these are new. Uh, a poltergeist. Okay, so we have anchor geists and poltergeists. Careless. Oh, whoa, he teleported. Oh my god, did you see that? He used instant transmission. I thought only Goku could do that. And the guys from Yardrat, or whatever that planet was called. I think it was Yardrat. Ooh! That and Cell, after Goku died, spoilers, on a show that was like 30 years old. Or not 30, but you know. Oh my god! Keep going with 22 HP! Ugh. I'm amazing! No! Damn it, I died. <laughs> you saw that coming. Alright, well, hey, I got the free life bottle, so I may as well use it. We're done. Yeah. And hey, I still got great for that somehow. And why did they have a holy bottle? That's weird. Ooh, a seal bottle. Uh, let's see, what else do we got? Yeah, usually if you come in these rooms, you just gotta check around. They're not. Sometimes there's no chests, but if you check around, you can find stuff. So, yeah. Okay, I guess that's it. Magic lenses and seal bottles. That's fine. Because seal bottles are really useful. Uh, I guess we just gotta go up. So let's do it. Okay, I know there's a memory circle. Oh, no, 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 I didn't want to go back down. My bad. Uh, I know there's a memory circle around here eventually. And hey, look, another door. Let's go in here. Oh, damn it. 
Well, at least these fights are pretty easy. It's just two enemies. Because, like, that first fight was honestly pretty rough with all four of those enemies. Like, man. Oh, good. Perfect. Damn, that's a good combo. 57. Oh, oh, damn. 64 hits. That's a really good combo. Okay, there we go. What is down? Oh, right, Shining Fang. What's up? So don't pick any more fights. Okay. I thought he was about to say son of a bitch. <laughs> that would have been really funny. Uh, what's up? Oh, I still have Fang Strike and then Cerberus. Oh, no, I don't have Cerberus Strike anymore. What the hell am I talking about? Okay. Takemi Nazuki or Zuchi. Cool. Takemi Nazuchi. Cool. It is a dagger made out of electricity, electrically charged ore. The well polished blade is like a mirror. Lucky limit, over limit boost. Nice. Okay. It's over here. A ghost, apparently. Hold still. I'll make this quick. Yeah. I. Oh, jeez. Teleported in front of me. Oh my god, it was terrifying. Okay, ow. Okay, ow. I should probably heal! I'm going to. Don't worry, I'm not going to be stupid like last time. I'm actually going to heal this time. Okay. There. No, don't hit me! Oh, I said don't hit me! Don't hit me! Okay. Oh, man. I really should have brought a heal. Oh, I just... I thought Raven would have got it by now. Man. When does he get it? It's called a love shot, I believe. And yes, I know. All right. They know each other way too well. Uh, okay. Well, I mean, he is my dog. You'd think I would know him and his personality, so yeah. I think you're just jealous, Rita. Because you've never had a friend in your life. Oh, oh, there's a ghost over here, too. Hold still. I'll make this quick. Or two. Two ghosts. This is a lot of ghosts on this one ship. Man. Yeah, jump around. He's a happy ghost. Damn it. No. Okay. Good. There are some enemies that you actually can't do that to, like um, Crushing Eagle, because it's a, like an, an art that's all on the ground. Sometimes you actually won't hit people with it. So that can be a little bit annoying when an enemy just avoids it just by, you know, how they... What? Are you serious? There's one right there, too? Man! Endless fights. Man, I just want to get to the friggin' memory circle. Ow. Stop it. Ah, oh, damn merman. Damn Freda fish. So why not just call it Shark Man? Why not just a Sharkman or something? I don't know. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, I know, right? It was awesome of me to punch. <laughs> Damn it, Rita. That always looks really funny. I love it when she smacks people with the book. It just looks really funny. Oh, man. I can see some... Oh, Snipe Zephos or something. Oh, wow. That's a really good bow. Increases HP. Just increases everything. That's awesome. A lightweight and compact bow. Suited for beginners. Okay. Interesting. Um, I'm going to heal a little bit. Because... Friggin Raven isn't getting his thing. There. Okay. So what do we got in here? Uh, you know what? I'm going to use a holy bottle. There. Um, let's see. Ah, food. Dried seaweed, rice. <laughs> I'm not surprised about the seaweed. Get out of my way. None here. Good. What's this? Oh! Let's eliminate them. It's a fake. Okay. What do we got? Twenty-two thousand. Give me some gold. Ow! God, your breath is horrible. Okay. Ooh! Oh no! Don't eat me. Okay, thank you. God, these boxes are always so weird. Oh, wow. Man, remember how hard those guys were to kill in freaking Tales of Symphonia? God. 
I, I wish they weren't so easy to kill. Ooh, we got a specific. Awesome. Totally worth it. But yeah, I wish they made them a little bit harder to kill. And God, I don't want to keep recording. Give me the memory circle. I want to stop. <laughs> Please? Memory circle? Where is it? <laughs> I can't find it. Uh, I can't find the memory circle. Damn it. Okay. Uh, holy bottle. Yay, thank you. Give me a read. Oh! Uh. Yeah, I guess we'll fight. This is gonna be a long episode. I honestly shouldn't be using Dragon Swarm in so many arcane arts. I should really just stick to Azure Edge. There we go. Good. Thank you, Repeat. How did we get a fragment of a spirit? Isn't a fragment, like, just a piece? So what are you going to put a fragment of something that's ethereal in? Whatever. Maybe it's just a piece of the cloth that it was in or something? I don't know. Because, it, I mean, it specifically says spirit fragment. It doesn't say, like, ghost cloth fragment. So, yeah. Let's go through the hallway. I'm sure nothing could possibly go wrong. Look at that! Oh, no! Something... The camera shook! And the door closed. Ah! Yeah. Well, that sucks. It's no good. It won't open. You see? I'm holding my hand out towards it. Normally, doors do that. Normally, they open when I just hold my hand up in front of it. <laughs> this is why I didn't want to come. I guess we just got to keep moving. <laughs> Hurry! Let's keep moving! <laughs> yep, let's go. wonder if everyone we left behind is okay. Well, why wouldn't they be? It was just a door. Oh my, what happened? Oh, the, the mast fell. I can't believe the mast would suddenly collapse like that. Yeah. Are you all okay? Well, it didn't fall on us. I hope Yuri and the others are okay. I'd be surprised if they came out of an impact like that without a few scratches. I, I'm worried about everyone. Um, Would it be alright if we went and checked on them? Now, hold on just a second. Who will protect the ship while you're gone? I'm sorry, but protecting Estelle is the guild's most important task, not you. I'm sorry. I can't stand not knowing what happened to my friends. <sighs> yes, I suppose we don't have a choice. Everyone be careful. I'm sure it, it sure is creepy with just us here. Yeek, don't say things like that. Talk about something more fun. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> okay. Oh. I can't go back and save? Okay, Estelle talks to herself. I'm worried about the others, of course, but this place is scary. Let's make this quick. Uh, okay. Why didn't we have anybody else in the skit? Oh, and wait a minute. No, I'm not going as a style. I'm going as Carol, if anybody. Even though I still suck as Carol. But okay. Uh, change leader. Okay, so I'm ending it off. Next time, we're going to go in the ship. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. Bye. Bye.